A couple of years ago, Eric Asimov, the New York Times wine critic, did a piece on Chateauneuf du Pop, and he was critical about the high alcohol levels in some of the wines, and he was, I, I guess, suggesting that some of the winemakers may have been making wines to chase scores and making these big kind of uh, fruit bombs that would appeal to someone like, or they thought would appeal to someone like Robert Parker. Mm. Is, is that something that, that you've seen in the region? Of course. Of course, it's really, it's true. I mean, uh, people. Uh, <coughs> so, in your question, there is two questions. Yeah. First question is: Does the Chateauneuf du Pape red is more rich than it was, and is it natural or is it marketing wise? Uh, <coughs> if we take the the Vieux Telegraph example, which is not a good example, but it's one of them. Uh, in 19, 1962, of Henri, our father, explained us that the average percentage of alcohol done in 2,000 hectoliters, that an average harvest at Vieux Telegraph, was 16.2, 1962. Um, so it's just to give you, just to give you where we are coming from. The Grenache is not ripe at 13% of alcohol. Grenache at Vieux Telegraph on the Plateau de la Croix is ripe at 15% of alcohol. That's, that's a reality. It's 13 years we are, exp we are doing experimentation on this for our generation. Our father made his, 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 his experimentation also. So it's, it's, it's a reality. So no, or the Vieux Telegraph will not be one day 13% of alcohol. It's still from the beginning 15, it will stay 15. Just because for us, the grapes are ripe at this, at this, uh, at this level. Um, there what is, about climate change? Yeah, th there is a, a, a bemol in this, uh, in this maturity. The grapes arrive at this, at this percentage of, of maturity, at this complete, uh, at this complete uh, uh, maturity process about 15 days before they arrived, uh, uh, let's say, at the end of the 70s, beginning of 80s. So it's not a, it's not a long time, it's a generation, mm -hmm. working generation. We, we win about average 15 days of, of, of maturity process. We, we short, the cycle of vegetation uh, is shorter 15 days than it was some years ago. Uh, that's certainly a, a, a consequence of the global warming. Today we cannot say the maturity is not complete because uh, I think we, we achieve great maturity. 15 days is not, it's not a big deal, I think. But it's an evolution. We don't know what will be the future on, on this. But why do we harvest 15 days earlier than we did? It's just to, com to, to, to respect this kind of balance we have, to respect this kind of, 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 uh, of level of, of alcohol in the wine, this kind of personality of what the Vieux Telegraph is. And, and we arrive to the second question. Uh, why people in chateauneuf du Pape uh, are increasing in terms of percentage of alcohol, or in, ter in terms of concentration, in terms of... It's because now the climate uh, is changing and they, and they have the possibility to do it a bit more just because when you arrive uh, normally to get, to get this kind of 16 point something, it should be uh, 15 of October 30 years ago. Now it's, it's the end of September. So it's a bit, it's a bit less risky. And, and, the, 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 and they, they do this just because climate is good, just because it goes, and just because they are asked by the journalists to make fruit bomb. It's, it's, there, is no, there is no other response to, to this. Yes, some terroir needs to be work in the winery to be good. The, that's it. 